I think I killed myself when I was a bee. Oh! Sick dance move. <laughs> that was awesome, Barry. All right. Why didn't he do that, actually, though? Uh, he was stuck in oh. midair. Oh, yeah. Platinum. So, here's my idea for game design. Take this shit out and just let you play the levels. Because there's enough stuff that maybe you'd want to play uh, the other games. Oh, we have three... No, the no, credits don't count as a level. Okay. Well, they count, but... Oh, shit. Dude, uh -oh. Trapped is against Ken. Is it, do you oh, get shit. to surf in the toilet? Oh! Big fleshy human thing? Man, they... They do not give up on Ken. <laughs> Is he, did he go to a flashback or something? PTSD? What the fuck? Ken and I thought Ken was attacking the hive and that That's was going to be their spin-off was that he comes after them. I'm sick of this shit! I'm gonna destroy every beehive in existence. You show up to my house and, and you, keep, you keep putting these cameras in my face. I'm gonna solve the whole problem for the human race nice and easy. Why is yogurt night so difficult? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. All right, it's enough of you. Jeanette, she's actually in the movie. She's supposed to be the weather woman. I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, remember? I do remember her do being in the movie. Think I don't see what you're up to. I'm sorry. You're trying to steal my girl. Why is his... He knows it. What's with his head? It's like off his <laughs> neck. <laughs> Italian Vogue. Mama Italian mean, Vogue, you know. Pages. Yeah, it's we just ripped these pages. lines right out of the what movie. <laughs> Why is your life any more valuable than mine? What's going on with his eyes? That's exactly what I'm remembering. Oh shit! Why why is there reticle? I'm shooting at him! Holy shit! He's frozen in space. I don't Holy fuck. I don't remember this at all. Dodge? Imagine if when you died you had to redo the entire game. <laughs> From the very beginning. Yes. Lock on. Oh, you're gonna get it now, Ken. You don't stand a chance to get my buzz action. That reminds me of the movie. It was like about rats. What was it called? Like, Flushed Away or something? Oh, like yeah. You know which one I'm talking about? I think it's called Flushed Away. It's like the really shitty animation. Like, yeah. It's almost disturbing. I think what happened with it, it was supposed to be stop motion. But I think there was like a, a fire that happened or something and they lost like all of it. So they had to reanimate it, but they just did it like normal animation. But they kept the weird art style. Yeah, it, did, it does look like ass. There's a hot part where the, the lady rat, her pants fall down. Ooh, that's what I'm looking for. Oh, oh mama. I love it when the rat panties fall. <laughs> but she's wearing boxers. Oh. Well, then that's not... Women can't wear boxers. <laughs> that's not allowed! What's he doing? Dude, he looks high. Because <laughs> all these chemicals he keeps spraying in a non well ventilated area. <laughs> yeah. Remember, kids, do not try this at home. He <laughs> is a professional. Yes. What the fuck? Did you hear him? Yeah. Yes! Yes! I completely missed a B that I've been trying to get for the past 10 minutes. He does hit like a tank, though. One hit is half my health. Oh, denied! Oh! Pwned! What the- Why is he <laughs> <through his side? laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the first time they ever showed their faces. Every other time they've been in a cutscene, they're facing towards Barry and the camera's behind them so they don't have to animate them talking. But now- they're pulling out all the stops for this finale. Oh, the stirrer. Oh yeah, you just get in the motion. Just keep going around and round and round. Is that the latest on Operation BRSPR? What the fuck? Yes, sir. Why do all the men in this this like game and movie all walk the same? <laughs> what is that? The fingers are bent backwards. Where are we? What this the is fuck? Knox. Holy shit! I don't remember this at all. What is happening? I don't know what we're doing. We're breaking. What the hell? What's that Dude, this looks like where Ant Man delicious. broke in to steal his suit from the first movie. <laughs> Why, it's honey. Oh, how I've missed a taste of the good stuff. What? Now, Ooh, I, could, I could just use one more drop. <laughs> ah, it's awful. 
I'm so like confused. Like he broke into a lab? Operation Burst Burr. Burst Burr. Brussels sprouts. To try yeah, some honey? Sprouts out of my mouth. That tastes like well, Brussels sprouts? Well, well. Oh, god damn it. It's gonna be one of those level cards to shoot things. That includes the stuff you beat They're still out. goddamn talking. Oh my god. I just my only <laughs> criticism for the game is there's too much dialogue. <laughs> Yeah, like, I point? could skip it, but I'm, I'm interested. Oh, kind of. Candy, he just, like, teleported to a lap. Because I don't remember, like, is this a level or is this just a, a, a really cutscene? Yeah, what's going on? Yeah, what's going on? Where you say, <laughs> it's just going into a movie. <laughs> right? yeah, something like that. Yeah, what's going on here? Yeah, what's, what's, what's going on here? No, no, what's going on here? What's going on here? You can't talk to me? What's going on here? I'll kick your ass up and down the street. Get him, boy! Oh, finally. Jesus Christ, it took him like five minutes to get to get him, boys. For all your viewers who didn't understand the what Quentin Tarantino well, Jeanette, reference there, he American said that while like wearing a huge sure winter well. coat being videotaped. You think that was like a cut level? Because they had the guys get him, boys, and it just cut to the next scene. I think this is a cut level that they didn't bother doing shit for. Because in the other part of the cutscene, you can see there's a little honey collectible in the drawer that she opened and closed. Which serves no purpose for the cutscene. How old do you think Montgomery is? 56. I think he's like 38 and just like <laughs> real aged super fast. <laughs> just did not age well. He's balding immediately. So he what, what, like corrupted his files? What was the, what was the lab? That's why I didn't want to skip it. That whole entire thing was nothing. And if we skipped it, we would have had no idea. So wait, wait. Was fuck? that even a fucking level? We did it was the Ken level. It was attached to the Ken level. What? That was the closing to the Ken level. That's what? Why? I think there was gonna be more where you broke into this lab to do something. This literally seems like it was the most delayed, like, worst thing they could produce. Well, let's do fight the final boss. Oh my god! Looks like he's Down Syndrome. <laughs> More like B Syndrome. Oh! <laughs> B Syndrome! So B Syndrome. I'm here to kill the bees, even though I lost the court case. I love the, the plot twist on this game, how different it is from the movie, where he's just an insane killer. Well, I mean, think about it. He literally probably went to law school for how many years, and then this fucking bee that hasn't been alive for more than a year comes in with no education and literally just whoops his ass. Well, he's got help, case. though. You know, he's not like just... From a florist and another bee. Besides, the court's not in session. But it's like it's like uh, alien life forms almost coming to because no one knew bees could talk or anything. They didn't know bees could have rights because they were just bugs before. Because for some reason they weren't allowed to talk to humans. Yeah, I don't understand how all like in these movies were like zookeeper. <laughs> <laughs> you did not just talk about zookeeper. How did the animals just Kevin like James is zookeeper? And the animal's just like, no, not to talk to the human. <laughs> like, <laughs> what animal? Was it just like that zoo that could talk, or was it all of the animals? He is built that way. Look at these, like, what is this? I know, I was Her, gonna say the same Dr. Thing. Doofenshmirtz self-destruct button fucking in the courtroom to turn on the fans. It's literally the only thing that's like, not normal colored. <laughs> it's gotta stand out. Even though there's a, like, little there's beef comb over it. Not only that, but there's also like great yellow things that are going towards it. Yeah. I'm kind of nice at the boss fight. I played that more than I played the Ken fight. I forgot the Ken fight was even in the game, to be honest. They really don't hide these collectibles at all. There's one right there, there's two right here, then there's one right behind it. Wait, how high can you fly up in here? I wonder if you can do the same thing in the restaurant. I guess we can try. It is a pretty tall ceiling, though. Oh! Oh, oh, no luck. No such luck. Damn. You trapped forever. <laughs> Look at that little pussy down there. What are you gonna do? Oh, you're so high up there. <laughs> it's a big building. It is. That's gotta be like a hundred foot ceiling right there. 
they have to just pay someone just to get cobwebs out of the corners. Well, no, they just don't that need 100 to. foot bees. Well, they do now. Well, the bees might be killed by them. We didn't get to see any. Oh, <laughs> he almost shot me, but it faded away. Look, now I can't find the button. Oh, never mind. Oh, get the fuck out of the way. I'm trying to press the button, you fool. I'm trying to beat the game. What the? Did you see that? There's no, two berries it. on screen at once. What? There was two berries. All right, well, I think we beat the game. Thank God. Ripping it off like a band-aid. He smacks his man pit. Oh! Here we go, game is won. You like that hop? That Got vertical? You know, for a big man, he can really move. <laughs> For a human being, he can really jump. I mean, he, he cleared that thing. It's like the gravity's just not there. <laughs> He's just that strong. His legs are that powerful. He won a court case against gravity. He no longer has to obey by Yeah, he did that right before. Well, he didn't win against the court case. He lost to it. And then he came in afterwards and killed gravity with his gun. And now he attained its powers. Yeah, and when Look he lost him. the court case, he you, went up to the he went up to gravity and threatened him by saying, "This is a perversion of nature." <laughs> yep. And then he, he showed up later with his gun and shot him to death. Finally, America can triumph. <laughs> I'm doing it for America. You see. That's why I have an eagle in my office. <laughs> Oh. Of justice aren't in your favor this time. He says that over and over again. The scales of justice aren't in your favor this time, B. He'll say it all the time. Every time he hits us. Too bad the scales of justice aren't in your favor this time, B. So true. And you can't avoid his uh, spray. You have to get hit by at least once. Because you can't go the full way around him. Alright! He's dead. We smash a giant chandelier on his head and he is dead. He is dead. Not a man could survive that. Montgomery is no mere man. Yeah. He he's a lawyer. So he's not knocked out. He's not breathing. He is no, he's entirely still. He's definitely not even moving. No. He is definitely dead. <laughs> he is actually dead. And the game is over. Now Barry has his second lawsuit. <laughs> Murder. Whoa, whoa, why is it- what? Oh! Da, 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 that's the end. Montgomery was actually God. <laughs> as soon as you killed him, the earth blows off. Let's see them credits, boys. Thank you, President Chris Johnson of Smart Bomb Interactive. We uh, should go out, find a beehive, strap it in a box, pull out each bee individually, and then tear out its <laughs> stinger. Just rip them apart. And then we could sell the bee parts. If you think about it. Yeah, we could. B parts for sale. Sound, music, voiceover. Okay. Woo, okay. music. Sound, okay. Voiceover cast. Jerry Seinfeld is actually in this oh. movie game. I knew it. And Patrick Warburton, they actually got him. And John Goodman. What the fuck? I don't know if they actually got them. They probably just ripped their lines out of the movie. And no, they have actually... new lines. All of the, all these, oh, all those they characters actually do. do. Yeah. They all, all those characters have different lines than in the movie. Holy fuck, how'd they actually get these guys? They have some that are re repeats, but they do have new jokes that don't land as well. It Not probably honestly took them five minutes to record that. Yeah. Can these credits be fucking over now? <laughs> quit to the main quit the main menu, dude. <laughs> the game's over. Get the hell out of here. Oh. <laughs> Hello, I finally got my actual Wii working, and this, this is not the account we played on, this is my 100% completion account, so I figured I would show off all the cool stuff we didn't get to see when playing through it just normally. So first off, we've got all the vehicles, all the costumes, I'm gonna go through the costumes first, because there's a lot. This one is like a UPS driver. I guess it's for the mail delivery game we never played, so I guess I'll go drive over there and play that. Here's my hot rod. I can't move the camera. There it is. Looking pretty slick, I know. And I'll show you all the cars later, too, but we just got to get through it all. Look at those nice little particle effects. 
This is a speed machine, let me tell you. I think this is it right here. Right? Probably. Yeah. We'll do mission one, because that's probably the shortest one. You're really not missing out on much. This is like the exact same game as the taxi game. But he's on a motorcycle. So you know it's more fun. Oh, uh, this is a lot more. Who wants to see this? No one wants to see this. We don't gotta do that. Forget I, forget I said we play that game. We're not playing that shit. Here's his uh, Han X outfit. Here, let's let's hold up traffic while we show. Well, we have a little fashion show here. So you already saw the hot rod, but uh, I want to. I want the last one to be a surprise because the the last one is your reward for 100% completing the game. We've seen the blue one, seen the hot rod. Here's this one. This one's pretty good too. I don't really know what it's supposed to be. But you got the extra wide load for ramming guys easier. Very fast. It's pretty cool looking. I won't lie. This was probably my favorite one to use as a kid. It's got the best handling, it's fast, it looks cool. Just the wide load. Red wide load. Not so not super great. I mean it's fine, but it's not too interesting. It's not like you can have anyone in the back. I mean you got so much room in the back seat. Maybe put some babes back in there. Maybe that'd be better, but No. This thing's just a tank. Uh not very better controls. Not very better controls. Not very good controls. It's about the same as the default car. Not very fun to drive in. Kind of looks like the dad robot from the movie Robots. You can use the taxi driver car. Or, but you sit in the back seat. Wait, what? He's sitting in the back. It, what? <laughs> He's not, his hands aren't even on the wheel. He's... What? Is that a bug? Did I, am I in the wrong seat? No, that's just how it works. How did they mess that up? I'm the passenger now. Alright, and here's the best car, my favorite car ever made. Say hello to the B car. Just wait till the camera... Here, I'll get the camera turned around, just a sec. Look at that. You tell me you wouldn't whip that shit? Look at that. He's not even, like, the right color. Like, we're clearly not that, like, brown. His eyes on there. It's like having a human car. That looks like you. It's, like, all fuzzy and shit. This is what you get for 100% completing the game. You spend all those hours getting every single thing. This is your reward. Yeah, it's just an average car. Like, it's it's better than the default one, I guess. It turns pretty well. But, yeah, we were shocked to find this out when we played. Because it's just so ugly. <laughs> Man, who made this shit? That shit's hilarious. It's so disgusting and weird. Oh, while we're here, let's, uh, stop by the museum. We got all of them. We being me and my sister, we played this. Because this was one of our first Wii games. Uh, costumes are forbidden in the museum. And that's the artwork view, is it just takes you behind it so you can't see it, really? But you can also get, like, paintings of concept art, I guess. I don't know if it was made for this game or if it was made for the movie and they were just putting it in the game. Because it looks more like... Can you get out of the way? Looks more like um, movie concept art. It's kind of weird that they have a statue of Ken in here. I mean, who... And this guy. Remember this guy? If I can... 
I'm not allowed to look at him. I'm sorry. Oh, there you go. That, that gives you a good view. Remember in Smash Brothers, the trophies? How you could, like, move the camera and stuff? This is much better. I really like looking at Ken and the guy in the back right. What is this? Oh, that's the thing. That's the thing. So this has to be concept art for the... Um, this fucking guy is constantly in the way. This has to be for the game, because this was the weird cutscene that never went anywhere. We didn't skip anything, I don't believe. That was just... That was weird. That was, a, that was the weirdest part of the game. We'll do Flight of the Bumblebee, I suppose. Oh, there's... There's different... Uh, there's different things in the Pollen Jock Academy. Look at this cool-ass fucking texture in here. That's just beautiful. And we got a whole new costume one. They made a whole different costume just for this. This is fun, right? This is the two-player mode. I know. I don't know if um, you got to see that when I was on the menu that there's two-player mode. You might have wondered what that is. It's just the Pollen Jock Academy games. You don't get to do like the levels or anything or explore the city. Well, we got that. That was that. We got 75 uh, honey, funny honeys from the. So again, you never want to do that when you actually play the game because. It gives you nothing, and you gotta grind up. Let's play some pollen ball. Comb crawler, please. Yeah, this is like the like cover-based shooting part. Okay, I guess it's killing it. It doesn't look like it's killing it. Like, the little effect they do. It doesn't look like it's hurting it. That's, oh, shit, that breaks. I guess we won. Yeah, so that was that game. I... <laughs> that was the Comb Crawler. Our next, Stingers of Navarone. B45, what the fuck? Buzzy the Kid. This looks like... Oh, this is the shooting gallery, right? Yeah, look. For Wii version only. Don't want to shoot the green guys, they're good. Barry is preparing for war. Take that, Mom. This is exhilarating. Uh, I Why does it gotta be shake the Wii remote? I, there's so many buttons on my freaking controller that could be used. That are being- Get out of the way, woman! I'm trying to shoot the other things! Get out! What the fuck was that? Did you see where my reticle was compared to where the ball went? We're not even centered on the track. We're off- we're going off the rails. Now we're going into the void. No, please. Not the void. Not again. Yeah, you still get 75. Okay. Drone gallery. We'll do the bastardly dragonflies. Welcome to drone gallery. It's like when you get those hunting games and the animals just run across. But what if it was instead dragonflies and you had to shake to reload? It's a massacre. Round two, baby. They're not even fighting back. We just trapped them all in here. We gave them no ammo. Oh, you know, hold up. I have a good idea. My one nunchuck is broken, so it thinks it's constantly moving, so I won't have to shake the Wii remote, or the nunchuck, rather. Let's see if that works. All right. Oh, yeah, we just found the strat. I don't even need my nunchuck. It's just sitting there. And it's automatically refilling. Oh, this is the strat. This is how I take my anger out. Urgh, take that Stacy, take that Veronica, that's what you get for friend zoning me once again. That'll show them. I feel power. Oh, that was it. Well, thank God I plugged in the broken thing. I only get 75. Like, there's the time limit doesn't even matter. I bet if you lose the time limit, you still get 75 uh, honey. I wish I could use my B car for the races, but. No, we get a racing car, which is another car we don't get to use in the hub world. I feel like that that's just like free stuff. Like they don't have to, they already modeled it. Why not just Cuz you make different cars. Like what if instead of having the red car, you just use this racing car instead? There's so many games you don't need to buy if you have the B-movie game. You don't need Mario Kart. You don't need House of the Dead or Link's Crossbow Training. You don't need any, like, flying games, you don't need GTA, you don't need Scarface, the world is yours. It's got it all in it. It's, it's all in here. This is the, the game to end all games. 
Oh, I'm about to lap these. Oh, that was it. To the arcade! The arcade is really something special. That's just where all the time and time and budget was sent to, was this arcade. It was not a last minute thing whatsoever. Look at that drift! That was a good drift. This is embarrassing, this game. This, look, this is probably some of the ugliest stuff I've seen on the Wii. And I've played Canada Hunt. Canada Hunt's probably like the ugliest game on the Wii overall. Like this is just like a side mini game. The whole game looked like this, it'd probably be the ugliest, but like Canada Hunt, oh boy. Let me know in the comments if you know any other um, like Wii games that are just like super ugly. But that's specifically like not any like WiiWare stuff. I'm talking like things that were sold in stores. Okay, Hive Insurgent. Look at Barry! <laughs> Drop honeycombs on approaching enemy bug. Enemy bug. Uh. Barry is so jaded at this point. Oh shit, red bug. The berry slide. Whoa, those are red bugs. They don't follow the paths. They don't follow the paths. Bastard bugs. Bastard fish. No! Away with you. See, they just fucking break your ankles. What are you supposed to do? It's cheating. Cheating bug. How do I lose? When is it over? Just let them all in. Be free, my bugs. Oh, shit. No. That's one layer. No, not main menu. Arcade. We're not playing the rest of that. This one's real good. Look at this. Oh, oh, this sounds really good. Tell me, th th does this hurt your eyes at all? My eyes feel great looking at this. I'm trying to see things. Oh, yeah, my eyes feel great when I'm looking at this shit. I keep running to damn frogs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I can react to this shit. Oh, just, you know what? Stay far left. I bet nothing spawns far left. Whole way, nothing. Whole way, nothing far left. Whole way, nothing far left. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> wow. Oh, that mushroom was a little close. Oh, they're, they're catching on. Oh, I don't think they can put stuff far enough to the left. And probably goes far right as well. Wow. I'm getting motion sick. I don't know about you guys, but I am... I, I can't look at this. I feel like I'm going to fall over if I look at this shit for too long. It's just for... Whoa! One thing in the way! Holy moly. Oh, wait. I'm not playing the game right. Hold up. You have to hit the flowers. You have to get 50 flowers. I. So you saw that game. You saw it with your eyes. You probably saw enough of it. You probably saw enough of it that you uh, threw up. You probably became sick seeing that. Also, that cutscene that displayed, I don't know if you noticed. It's supposed to be Barry whistling, seeing the arcade. But you may notice that Barry was not there. Civilian capture. Hornets have broken into a hive and are kidnapping citizen bees. Jesus Christ. Is this not the same fucking shit I just played? It's just... Oh my god. They're kidnapping the citizen bees. Whoa, son. Stop. 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 You're being bad. You're being bad. The frog cometh for Barry. I don't even have to talk about how ugly this looks. Like, you just know. I, y you can figure it out for yourself that this game is really ugly. Oh, get fucked, son. You ain't getting my hive. Just eat me, dog. Just do it. Come on, buddy. I'm wide open. I'm wide open. Come and get me. Come get me, frog. Almost got me. Oh, that was my life. Okay, yeah, no, I'm done.